everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be planning in my B6 So Much Crafting inserts. Well, more like back planning. I'm going to be planning the week of February 19th through the 25th, which was last week. And I will be using a kit today by Happy Honey Bee Designs. Um, I don't know if this is still in her shop. Um, because I got this like I think a year ago. I fell in love with the artwork, but when I got it, it, it just didn't work for the way that I plan in my main planner. And I was looking through my... Um, kits the other day and I thought oh this would work really well in the traveler's notebook so here we are <laughs> um, I'm gonna go through the sheets really quickly so here we have some checklists we have a clean and a today box we have some functional icons um, which I love these cameras and like the coffee and stuff so it's really pretty um, on this page we have your headers you have like some icons here and then we have some half boxes and like quarter boxes these like say work on them. I don't know if you can tell. So I'll, I want to use them. So we'll see if I can. Um, I'll probably put something over that. Um, on this page, you just have the checklist. This is like, this kit is like all over the place. <laughs> on this kit, or oh, whoa. On this page, we have your full boxes, which are really pretty. And if you've never watched any of my Plan With Me's before, I am like obsessed with coffee. So coffees and flowers, I just thought it was really, really pretty. So I'm excited that I'm getting a chance to use them today. And then <laughs> here's the bottom washi, which is so pretty. So you have the bottom washi, habit trackers, and important, well, two important boxes, the weekend banner, and some script words here. And yeah, that's the kit. So that's what I'll be using today. If you wanna go ahead and see how this turns out, then just keep watching. All right, so first we're gonna go ahead and start with the bottom washi as usual, and I'm gonna run it across here. I did forget, but I went ahead and whited out the corners there um, because if I don't white that out, um, it will show through. Like, it's yeah, it'll show through. So that's why I whited it out. And as always, I'm just lining this up with the top box so this sticker paper is definitely different um i don't know how to explain it it's a lot thicker than what i'm used to is this straight oh, i think it is it's a lot thicker than what i'm used to so it's glossy paper but just it's just different all right so there is the washi strip i think no it'll be fine i feel like i pushed it down a little bit too much but your girl is not pulling that back up, so it's going to stay there. Um, so there's that. So the kit didn't come with any date covers or glitter headers or anything like that. I don't, she may have offered it at the time, but um, I was fairly new to planning, so I didn't really know what I wanted in a kit when I picked this up. So if she did offer it, I didn't pick them up. So I found these from It's Just Paper Co. from a kit that I used um, in January, and I think this was accidentally sent to me like twice, like I had two of these. So I thought I would pull this in. I wasn't sure what color I was going to use. I think I was leaning towards this peachy color, but then I think like this pink is perfect. I think I'm gonna stick with the peachy color, I don't know. We'll see, I'll figure it out. And then um, since it didn't come with date covers, I did pull these from Simply Watercolor Co. And I decided to go with the light pink one and it's in gold foil. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that all down and I will be right back with you guys. So this is what it looks like. I'm already loving it. I like that I went ahead and um, went with like the peachy color and I did have to white out 
the dates because they were peeking through. All right, so now we can go ahead, I'll zoom you guys in and we can start day by day. All right, so now that we're zoomed in, we can go ahead and start day by day. So as always, and since this is a coffee kit, it is very fitting, I am going to go ahead and mark Coffee Monday. So since the kit didn't come with many quarter boxes, I'm gonna be pulling a lot of those in. And so I'm gonna be using one of these from Sticker Bloom. And I think I just wanna go with, I don't know, I can use the, like the green one or the peachy one. Kind of don't want that because it's right here, like the peach color. But I'm probably going to have to. Or you know what? She has like one of these quarter box things in the kit right here, which doesn't have anything up top. So maybe I'll use that here. Why do I feel like... Oh, wow. It doesn't... Are all these like this? It's not the width of the box, so I'm not used to that. And I'm kind of hoping like the half boxes aren't like that. Um, I don't want to put, hmm, okay. So let me go ahead and pull some washi. So I don't want to do anything floral. So I'm gonna go ahead and pull this pink and gold one that I had over there, I think, I'm pretty sure that I got this one from AliExpress. So I will put that there because I didn't realize that the boxes didn't go the whole width and I don't want white space on either side. So I'm gonna go ahead and layer this. I kinda wanna layer it like this, maybe. Okay, I'm gonna push it a little bit to this side because I am gonna be putting a coffee cup Maybe I can push it all the way, like off-center it a little bit and make this box work for me. So, hmm, I don't know, we'll see. But in the kit, she does have a coffee cup. Let me find it. So in the kit, she has a few coffee cups to choose from and I really wanted to use this one with like the little steam coming up, but I also love this one. So let's see how, ooh. Oh no, the steam isn't even cut out. Okay, so I guess that's a sign. I will use the other coffee right here. Or I can, let me see how the other one looks. I'm already starting off really indecisive. Okay, so I'll put this one here. Yeah, that'll work, that's cute. So I'll put that one there to mark Coffee Monday and then um, that day I did close my shop, so I'm gonna put a to-do header to mark that I closed my shop, and I'll put that right here. Right, okay. Then I am gonna take one of those quarter boxes, and I feel like I can pull green into this kit to some degree. I feel, why is my plan? I feel like my the pages are like, I don't know, they're weird today maybe I'll do let me find it all right so I have these from Aria's daydream and I think I'm gonna pull in I can pull in purple and green I feel like um, maybe I'll do the mint green hmm okay I'll do the mint green one here and I'll turn it this way mm -mm. I want it up a little bit more. I don't know. I feel like these aren't sticking down. So hopefully that won't give me a problem. So I'm gonna put that there. And then tomorrow closing my shop, I'm gonna take one of these laptops from Mon Petit Planner. And I'll probably just take, hmm. I'll probably take this peach one. Is this crooked? No. Or maybe a pink? I don't know. I'll take this peach looking one. Doesn't really matter. I'm gonna put that here to mark closing my shop. I may wanna layer a bow, I'm not sure yet. And then down here, I wanna mark that I spent the rest of the day working on orders. So I'm gonna use this half box here from the kit. And, okay, so the half boxes are not the same, but they are thicker. I don't know how to explain it. I'm gonna turn it this way 
so that the florals are on the bottom. And I can't get it. Something's just not right, I feel like. Okay, I'm gonna put that there. And to mark that I was working on orders, I pulled these from Tasseled Planner. And I think I'm gonna go with like the peachy pink one here. And put that down here in the middle. I feel like that's not the middle. I do have tweezers that I should be using, but I'm stubborn. Okay, so that is to mark that I had to close my shop. So then, um, right here in the middle, that's where I usually put my full boxes, and they're all beautiful. I love all these full boxes. This is what drew me to the kit. Um, so I think I'm for sure gonna do this one. I think when I was looking at the kit, I was thinking about these two. But I really love this one too. Um, but I want to show the whole coffee cup. So I am going to put these two down. And I think I'm going to start with the coffee cup one. And put that here. I feel like these are shorter too. Or maybe it's just my... No, these are definitely shorter. And which one? Okay, this floral one here. Yeah, that's what I wanted to do. And then just I'm leaving a little bit of uh, a little bit of white space in between these boxes. I'm trying to imitate what I did on the other side. Okay, so I'll put those there. It's so pretty. I love this, and it's so different too. Um, so then I will put. I kind of want to put washi instead of glitter headers down here, but I feel like the boxes are already busy enough. So, uh -huh. I'm trying to think, should I just go with pink? I'm just going to go with the pink ones. Although I could go with lilac, but I'm just going to be safe and go with the pink ones here. Does she have washi strips? No, she doesn't have any washi strips, which I wish she did. Because I kind of don't want to use these down here. You know what, I'm just gonna go ahead. Okay, I have an idea. So I have this skinny washi here to the side. I think I'm gonna save these. So I have this one here. It's like a mauve pink. I, got, I just got it from Hobby Lobby. And it has little hearts on them. So basically, I just wanna kinda separate the full boxes from what, I'm, what I am about to put down here. Yeah, that's really pretty. So I am going to use this washi to do so, and I'm gonna go ahead and do the same thing on the other side. Okay, so that is what I'm doing there, and so down here is where I'm gonna use these boxes here from Aria's Daydream, and I'm gonna do pink first. I kinda like this peach too. I don't know how it would look with this. Nah, it works with this kit. So I'm going to put this here. And this is to mark what happened on Tuesday. I think that's when I, yeah. I had like, so I've been, I, I've been sick for the past few weeks. And slowly, slowly been getting better. And this day, like, I felt a ton better. And so I just went on a cleaning spree, basically. <laughs> like the house was... I don't know. Like, my daughter was cleaning her own room, and it wasn't clean. But I didn't have the energy to get on her about it. So that's what I spent most of Tuesday doing. I have two ways to mark that. So I have these from Spencer and Jude, and I have these from Hello Petite Paper. And I think I'm going to use the ones from Hello Petite Paper. Um, only because I feel like they go with the kit a lot better. Does she? No, she doesn't have anything in the kit. Hmm. Like, I want to use the spray bottle, but I don't want to use the last one. So I'm just going to go ahead and use the spray bottle. And is that what I want to use? Or maybe I'll use the mop bucket. The only reason is because the spray bottle has blue at the top, and I feel like that doesn't really go with the kit. I have this one, though. No. 
the lighter pink is better. So I am going to use this mop a bucket right here. And that's just to symbolize that I had or that I cleaned that day. And then on Wednesday, I'm gonna go ahead and put another one of those quarter box labels from Aria's Daydream. And I'm thinking I'm going with the green. Let's see how that looks. <laughs> Not a big fan. Nope, maybe I'll stick with the pink then. I feel like that's so similar to that color too that it's going to bother me. Let's see how this yellow looks with the kit. No, mm -mm. Did I try the purple already? I didn't, I don't think so, I don't remember. Okay, I think I'm just gonna stick with the pink because that is the safest option at the moment. So I'll stick the pink down here. Yeah, that's what I'll do. And then here I wanna mark that I went and got my nails done that day, which was very much needed. And, hmm. I'm kind of feeling the mint green for some reason. These are by Mon Petit Planner, but I don't know how this green looks. Oh, she has like this peachy color, so that's what I'll use. So she has this peachy color here, so I'll go ahead and put that there, and that's to mark that I went and got a manicure. And then on Thursday, what do I do on Thursday? Okay, so, hmm. So I'm gonna put a half box first. Where are the half boxes? All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and take one of these half boxes and I'm really liking this one. Okay. And I will put that, is that what I wanna do? Yeah, I'm gonna put this up here because um, one of the first things I did was go grocery shopping because I knew that I would be out of town that weekend and I didn't really wanna worry about food when I came back is basically it. So, went there, and because my, my three-year-old was like, Mommy, you need to go food shopping. So, if she's saying it, then, I mean, I need to go. <laughs> so, I'm going to take this shopping cart, and this is from Stationery Heaven Co. I'm obsessed with this shop. And I'm going to take, like, the peachy one, and I'm going to put it here to mark... Oops. Stuck down before I wanted it to. So, just to mark that I... Did some food shopping that day. Perfect. And then I'm gonna take that washi again, or maybe I wanna take, I pulled a ton of washi that I had some that went with the kit. So I have this floral one. What do I wanna mark next? Okay, so I'll take this floral one here, but I kinda want it all the same too. So I'll take the heart one again. Plus it takes up less space, so that's what I'll do. I'll take the heart washi here. And then I am going to take, hmm. Well, I need a mark, okay. So here I wanna mark that I filmed that day. And let's see what she has in my kit. All right, so I found these by Scribble Prince Co. and I just pulled a whole bunch of leftover stuff. So hopefully that will help. So I have this light pink one. I don't know what kit that's from. I think it's from the one I used last week. So I'll put this here, just like that. And then to mark filming, in the kit she has the cutest cameras right here. So that's what I am going to be using because I did film that day. So I will put that right here. And I may want to layer a bow on top of that I did pull some from Clever Gal Crafts in the Sophie Pink colorway. I was gonna say colorway again. But I don't know, I don't wanna... Um, I feel like the camera should have went higher. And I feel like this paper is going to be hard to peel back up. Yeah, that's like down. Yeah, I really want a bow, because or let's see, we'll see. If I feel like I really need one, I'll pull it back up. Okay, so then after that, um, I did have to pack at least my, I think that day, not did, but I did 
pack my girls their suitcases. So I think I'm gonna take a today header right down here. And then I need something small or not too big. So she does have these that I can probably cut down, but I don't wanna layer wash it because it doesn't go with the width of the box. So let's see what I have here. All right, so what I went ahead and did is she has these work boxes. So I just cut off the word work because I didn't wanna put anything else down here that was plain. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna push this all the way to the right because it doesn't go the width of the box. And then what I'm gonna use to mark packing, um, I'm gonna push it up against that side so that you don't see that white space. So I'm gonna put that there. Then I do have these by Planaresque. And at the time, I was thinking about the lilac one, but um, there's not much lilac in the kit. Oh, I have these too. So I have these also by Lovely Plenary. I just feel like they're really big. Um, okay, maybe a light or green. How does that look? I feel like that looks out of place. So, no. Let me go ahead and pull something else. All right, so I have these by Wild Sunshine Co. And I went ahead and grabbed the gray one just because I thought it was neutral and not pink. So I'm gonna push it up a little bit there because I do for sure wanna layer a bow here since I wasn't able to do it down there. So I'm gonna take one from Clever Gal Crafts and layer it right here. Perfect, and that's to mark packing my girls. And then on Friday, um, so in the, during the day, um, my sister-in-law was over so, let's see, what do I have to mark that? Okay. Um, I don't want to do it in a half box, but I don't know. This isn't coming out. Or maybe I'm just talking too soon, and it will be good. So, I'm trying to figure out all these leftovers that I have because I don't want to keep using the same colors over and over, but I think I'm going to do the same thing I did down here. I'm gonna cut one of these boxes down. Like just cut the work part down. So, so you guys can see how I did it. I, the whole word isn't gone, but you can't really tell. It kind of blends in with the leaves and stuff. So I'm probably gonna put it this way and I'm gonna push it up against this side as well. Let me go ahead and do it like this. I'm sorry if I'm flipping, wow. Uh, I'm sorry if I'm flipping you over. It's just easier for me. I almost said I'm sorry I'm flipping you off. That's what I almost said. Okay, so there's that. My sister-in-law came over, which I was super excited about because she surprised me with some Starbucks. So I'm gonna put this coffee cup, which is so cute. And this is from like a sampler from Hello Petite Paper because she did bring some Starbucks over and I was so happy to see her because I was working all week to get all the orders done. I was probably running on like two hours of sleep that day and I had like a few orders left and I wanted to get it done before I left, like before I went out of town. And so I was like, it was between that or taking a nap and I wanted to take a nap so bad. I almost said, you know what, I'll just, finish it when I come back and then she showed up so I kind of like had to stay up to entertain her but it was a blessing because I really needed that so she came over so I wanted to mark that and then I did want to mark that she was here and she was very understanding so she sat with me in my office downstairs and like you know kept me company until I was able to finish orders which was awesome. So I'm gonna take that washi there. And 
which was also nice because then my daughter had her cousin over and they were playing. They're around the same age. So I'm going to take that washi there and then I am going to take a half box for this, but I am going to take a gray one from a leftover kit from Scribble Prince Co. Um, nope, that's too much gray going on there or like that box is whited out. So I'm going to take one from the box and maybe one that has a lot of florals around it that doesn't look like this one. So I'm going to put this here. Usually my, uh, my mailman, he's like the sweetest guy ever. Where's my, okay. So I have these bows to mark orders from Tasseled Planner. But um, we've been doing this thing now where he delivers my mail, but he doesn't pick up my mail because he usually comes around 12 30 one o'clock and I can usually get more orders out if he comes just a little bit later so he delivered my mail which was what I needed to finish one order so I was able to get that one order done and out as well as the other orders so I was completely zeroed out on orders and I was so happy so I want to mark that and then I think ooh, there's a today header here hmm Okay, so I may need to switch these. I should have put the washi down here. Let's see if I, where are the headers at. Okay, let's see if I can do it without because that bow is on top of there. Okay, let me put this down here first, like that. And then let me put, oh, you know what? I don't know, I don't wanna use another glitter header. Should I put it to do? I feel like it needs pink up there, so I'd rather put it to day, but I'll put it to do, that's fine. And hopefully I can get this straight without having to pull up anything else. So, how does that look? Hmm. I would like for this bow to be a little bit lower now. I probably should take out, ooh, this is coming up with the box. That bow's gonna stay right there. Okay, so down here I wanna mark that we, like when my husband came home, we went um, to my mom's house. So I probably wanna do that and I'll probably take one of these now. And I'll probably take a peach one. Is that what I want to do? All right, so these are the boxes and I think I'm gonna go with the mint green again. And what do I have to mark? Okay, yeah, I'm definitely going with the mint green. I'll put that down here. And we finally made it to my mom's house. I've been trying to go there for two weeks now. Um, I'm gonna take this peach one. This is a house from Lexi Kylie Designs and I will take it right here and that is to mark that we went to my mom's. So Saturday was super exciting. I think the first thing I want to mark is that my mom did my hair, finally. I was like in desperate need of that. So I think what I want to do is, um, I definitely want to take that in a quarter box. And maybe I'll do, oh, I have these. So I have these also by Scribble Prince Co. And yeah, so I'm gonna take this here. My hair took forever. I have a lot of hair and it, I was in desperate need of it. So it took quite some time. I might take this mint green. This is from its planning time. Hmm. Maybe I'll take pink. Um, it was a process. I had to get it relaxed. Then my mom had to blow dry it out. Then last minute we decided to color it, which I don't recommend coloring your hair after you relaxed it, but I know my hair and it can take it. So I did that, I cut, we colored it, and then I had to wash it off again, and then blow dry it out, then straight iron it, like with a straightener. So. That took almost all day, to be very honest with you. So my mom did my hair, and then after that, my husband took me to Hobby Lobby. It, that wasn't the plan. I was supposed to have my hair done. Hmm. I'll, to, I'll do the washi. 
I was supposed to have my hair done and then go like to Hobby Lobby and Michaels and Marshalls with my mom. But me and my husband also wanted to, um, since my mom offered to watch the girls, we wanted to take like a chance to go do something together. So we wanted to go see a movie and have dinner. So I couldn't fit all that in. So he had to go to a Hobby Lobby with me. He was very patient <laughs> as I was looking through all the papers and stuff. He even tried to help, but no, no. But he was very nice about it. So I do want to mark that I did that. And I'll probably want to take one of these quarter boxes again. Hmm. I'll probably take the peach one. And I'll put it right here. And the Hobby Lobby is right next to the movie theater. So that worked out. My mom took the kids to um, Chuck E. Cheese, so they had fun too. And my brother was there and his son was there, so they were able to spend time with my nephew. Okay, so I have this book from the Coffee Monsters Co. is her Planner Girl sticker book. And I was looking at this washi tape, but now that I see it... I just don't know. I like this scrapbook paper too. I think that's so cute. And I did go in for paper. So let me see. This is like her Michael sheet, but same thing, you know. Let's see if this, yeah, I think this will be cute. A little scrapbook paper. I think that's so cute. Like I'm a sucker for hand-drawn doodles. Okay, so that's there. And then I do want to fit a half box here. So... But I also want to fit a header. I'm thinking about, you know, I'm just going to keep going with the florals. So I'm thinking they're all florals, but they're quite different. Hmm. Okay, so I can take a header. I can squeeze one in there. If I can find the headers, where they go. I can't believe this. The headers were on the same page that I just pulled this half box from. <sighs> sometimes okay so I'm gonna take this today header and I'm gonna put it here I'm gonna try to push it up as much as I can but I don't want to push it all the way up to that box so I'll put it here I'll put this half box down here it's gonna go further down but it's okay I can deal with it because I rather have white space in between that the header and that so I'll put that down here because my husband and I had date night which we hardly ever get because we live away from family and stuff, so we hardly get that. We went to the movies, and then we went to eat. It was so much fun. We went and saw Black Panther, which, life. I hardly recommend that movie. I am not into superhero movies at all, but that movie has me, like, wanting to know everything. I want to know, like, the history of Wakanda. I want to know... Like the backstory, I'm con I, I'm a big reader, so I'm like, should I buy the comics? <laughs> I know it's weird. Anyways, I'm gonna put this popcorn bag from Hello Petite Paper. I'm just not sure how I want to do this. Um. Okay, I definitely want to put what we went and saw. So I'm gonna put the popcorn right here, and I kind of want to work this. Maybe a heart from this tassel planner sheet. I've been dying to use one. And, ooh, that would have been really cute if they're like right next to each other. Okay, so let me go ahead and pull this up with undo. Okay, so I think that's dry enough. So I'm gonna put this over a little bit. Maybe I should do it on my finger first before I put it down. I think this is so cute. And I do have a coupon code for her shop. It's Two Little Bow Babies. And that'll get you 15% off. And if you use, like if you put my name in the notes to seller, you get a special freebie on top of that. I just went ahead and picked some, some of my favorites from her shop. So I'm definitely excited to show you guys that. I like that. I just wish the heart was this way. So I want to get it perfect. So I'll be right back. All right, so that's how I put it down. I think that's so cute. I love I love that heart. I think it's really pretty. It's good for layering. So that is what I went, or that is what I chose to mark that. Um, if you guys haven't seen the movie, I definitely like highly recommend it. It was really good. 
Okay, so then Sunday we came back home. So I'm gonna put that in a half box. That's what I wanna do. It took us quite some time. It always does. So, hmm. I'm gonna put this right here. A little bit of space at the top because I wanna go ahead and layer this. Ooh, I don't know if this is gonna give me, it might. Layer this car. This is another sampler from Hello Petite Paper. And I wanna layer it up here just to mark that we came back home. And then I'll probably put it to do header right here because I did film when I came back home because I wasn't able to film my plane with me before I left because there was just too much stuff going on. So I'm gonna put that there. I think I wanna take that into, I don't want anything too big. Even though I think what I want for down here is not going to fit. Although I could, hmm. All right, I'm gonna pull this up. I'm so sorry, but I got an idea. So let me go ahead and pull this up. All right, so I am going to put this washi down first because I wanted to mark that I filmed my plan with me and that I spent the rest of the afternoon organizing my planner space and rearranging some stuff and playing in my planner, doing all things that planner girls do. So this can actually symbolize all of that to me. So I'm gonna take this Artsy Girls desk from the Coffee Monsters Co. I just hauled this and I was so ready to use this. So I am gonna put this right here underneath the washi and then I'm gonna put some washi in the bottom, but I'm gonna take the floral washi that I've been wanting to use. I think this goes really well with the kit. And I got this washi from Michaels just recently. So I will put that there. And that is it, this looks so pretty. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and work on this section here. I do know that I wanna take the last um, thing. I don't even know what you call it. You know what I'm talking about, the last glitter header. And I just noticed that she does not have a weekly tracker either in the kit. So while I was like just looking to the right, I just saw this. Um, I have like a pile of leftover stickers. And this is from a kit I used a while back from It's Just Paper Co. I think the pink matches pretty well. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put, I'm gonna flip this over. I'm sorry if that bothers anybody. I say that all the time, but I am really sorry. Okay, so I'll put that here. Hmm. I'll deal with it. Then I'm gonna take this weekly tracker thing from, it's just Paper Co. I'm going to cut off the little top part for the header. I'm not a big fan of those. So I'll cut that part off and then I'll just use that here. I'm probably gonna have to white out. Hmm. I'll see what I'll come up with. Should I white it out now? No, Ooh, don't stick down. So I'm gonna put that here. It's kind of hard because I laid this glitter header down crooked. So I flipped you guys over for no reason. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but I did, so I'm trying to line it up with the crookedness I got going on up here. And it's fine, I'll just white it out. Um, my washi will just go up further than it usually does, so where's the white out? So down here I do like to put washi. So I've been, finding an opportunity to use this washi. Um, this is from Simply Gilded, and it was from like her nudes collection. Is it nudes, is it natural? I don't know, but you know, that collection. And I think I wanna do this with something from the kit. I also have some washi of my own as well that would work. So I'm gonna put this down first. Hmm, no. I'm gonna put this down first. I'm gonna leave a little bit of white space. I don't know if that's gonna give me enough room. And this is cut crooked. Okay. I'm gonna take this one first. 
and line it up here. I should have whited it out, but I didn't. That's fine. And then I'm going to use, I want, really want to use this, but if you see, I'm going to have white space down here too. So I wonder if I'll probably have to use two thick ones, which is fine. I could have doubled up too. I also have this that I got from Michael's. It, it looks like the other one, but it was not in the same tube. And this actually goes this way because it's, I kind of just want the flower part. So I will put that here. I'll probably have to cut it just a little bit because it's too thick and the other one is too thin. And I'm having a Goldilocks moment right now. It's not just quite right. So let me go ahead and cut this down. All right, so I went ahead and just finished that off camera so that I didn't have to have you guys flipped over so long. <laughs> um, so I love how that turned out. I think it's so pretty. And then I whited these out just so I can get that done as well. And I am going to take this full box here. I'm dying to use this one, but I feel like that's up there. So um, I'm not going to use it. So I'm going to use this one. I think this one's perfect for this spot. So I'm gonna push it up here like I did last week. I really enjoyed using the full box last week instead of cutting it down. So that's what I'm gonna do there. And then I do use a glitter header here and I told you that she gave me two of these. So I was looking through my leftovers and I didn't use any of the peach ones. So I'm just gonna keep going with that peach um, glitter header. I am gonna turn you over for this part and I'm trying to line it up with this full box here. See, I always do that. It's too far this way. Can I bring it back up? Oh, yes. Okay, good. So let's start a little bit to the right. <laughs> okay, let's put that down there. And then I am going to use a full box and... I'm kind of feeling this one here. I'm gonna do it this way so that the florals are facing up. And I'm gonna to try to center it with this. Mm, I'm getting good at this, you guys. I used to struggle here. Okay, so down here I do want to put, um, you know, one of these, <laughs> a full box. And you guys, I don't know how it would look to have like smoke. Mm, it kind of blends into to this, but I kind of want to use it because then this is floral, so I don't want to do another floral. I'm going to do it. I'm going to use one of these. I'm going to cut it down. Oh, I'm eyeing it, and I'm super scared to eye this. I'm trying to think, do I... No, that looks like <laughs> looks like a little mustache, doesn't it? Like or like a beard. <laughs> oh goodness. Okay, so <laughs> I'm gonna cut it down. I'm gonna cut it down a little bit bigger because then if it's too big, I can always cut it down. But if it's too short, I can't. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead with my first instincts. I don't know how I feel about this. I don't know. No, I don't like that. Was it that way or was it this way? Either way, I don't like it. So we're gonna scratch that. So maybe I'll do some washi of my own. Let me see how that looks. I like that because it's pink, right? Yeah, it's pink and it's not, it's florals, but all the other ha or full boxes I have are the same floral. As this so I want it to be different so let me go ahead and wipe this out and lay this washi down all right so the washi didn't look quite right <laughs> so I changed that um, also we don't have a this week header so oh goodness okay so maybe I just want to do another I really don't I could put a to do header here yeah, I'm gonna put it to do. I'd rather do that. 
then another glitter header. So yeah, I just cut up that full box that I didn't want to use, but um, I'm gonna flip you guys over again. But at that, I had to end up using, which is fine. I will make it work once I add deco down there. So I'm gonna add this to do right here. And then I'm gonna go ahead and do the deco. And this box is just mainly for um, like something that stood out from the week or like a memory that I want to remember and stuff like that. So that's what that's for. She has a lot of pretty deco. I definitely love this enjoy banner thing that's going on here. Hmm. I don't wanna put it here, definitely don't. I know, okay, let's just do what I know I wanna do. I know I wanna do a flower here and I love this little heart. So I'll probably do like a little cluster down here of that so that it doesn't look too florally down there, if that's a word. And that's it because I'm gonna add a bow. I'm gonna add a foiled bow from Clever Gal Crafts to the corner here, just to give it some foil, and then I can write in, or wow, then I can write in what I want there. And I'm trying to look to see if I wanna add any bows anywhere else. I did want to here, but I mean, it's not working with me and I'm not going to pull it back up. Maybe I'll add one here, like on top of this artsy girl's desk. All right, so what I'm gonna go ahead and do now is fill this all in. I am using my Paper Mate Ink Joy Gel Pen in the 0.7, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that and I'll be right back. All right, so this is how it looks all filled out. I really do love it. I love how it came out. I love the coffee in it and the colors. I think it's really pretty. Um, I was having serious doubts like around Tuesday and Wednesday because I was freaking out that I didn't have any quarter boxes, but I do love how it turned out. Um, I'm going to go ahead and link all the shops that I used down below as well as any coupon codes that I do have. So go ahead and check that out. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.